Good morning. Today is Monday, March 7th, 2022, and it is day number 58 in my fasting journey. Yesterday, I weighed in at 181.4 pounds, and this morning, I just can't even believe this. I am at 180.2 pounds. Since yesterday, I've lost 1.2 pounds, and since the start of my fasting journey, I have lost a total of 38.8 pounds. I'm doing rolling 72s. I am in round three. I'm about 22 hours in. And each day, um, these rolling 72s could just continue to absolutely amaze me. So yesterday I had a huge refeed and I'm talking about like huge. Um, I had about 600 calories worth of bacon and then 16 ounces of fresh squeezed grapefruit juice. If I had to guess, um, in total, I probably had about 820 calories worth of food, and I had this huge weight loss on the scale, and there are probably like several reasons why I had this weight loss, and I think the main reason why is, first of all, um, I am not afraid of fat. Um, I've been doing keto for a while, and um, I've had several um, attempts at the carnivore diet and so I know that there is nothing to fear in terms of fat and the bacon that I had yesterday was just absolutely dripping in fat and I ate it I enjoyed it it was filling but I also knew that I needed to be near the bathroom and so later in the evening I could feel like this burning sensation in my stomach and I knew that um Things were about to start to happen, and they definitely did. Um, all that fat from the bacon cleaned me out, and I am certain that is like the main reason why I lost 1.2 pounds yesterday. And the best part about you know the bacon cleaning me out is that I didn't even have to take my Mago 7, um, the oxygen based colon cleanser that I'm always talking about. And one of these days, I will do a video like completely devoted to Mago 7. Um, so another reason why I had like the huge like um, weight on the scale um, is because I have been faithfully walking 10,000 steps each day since um, March 1st. And what I have found is that when I eat, um, my when I get my steps in, my weight maintains. But when I'm fasting and I get my steps in, I lose a little bit more weight than I would um if I didn't get the steps in. And so as soon as I finished my last piece of bacon, I set my fasting app. And like I said, right now I'm about 22 hours in and I kind of feel like those extra steps that I was doing, um, as I got further into the day, further into my fast kind of contributed to the weight loss on the scale. And by the end of the day, after I'd gotten all my steps in and I'm about to go to sleep, I kind of check my watch and see how many calories I burned. And I don't remember the exact number, but I've been like averaging about five to 600 calories. And if that's actually true, then I basically burned most of what I had eaten earlier in the day. And so um, that would definitely be um, a contributing factor in the like large number that I lost on the scale. And another reason is that, okay, so my refeeds are in the morning now. And one of the reasons why I ha kind of wanted my refeeds to be in the morning is because um, after I finish eating, I set my fasting app and I kind of like, you know, have a lot of hours um, before I get on the scale um, again, like a lot of fasting hours. And so I think that kind of helps. Um, because that allows my fast to like work a little bit of its magic. So that way when I do get on the scale the next morning that I see like a little bit of a loss. I definitely did not expect to see like this huge loss. But I kind of feel like the closer I get to the 24 hour mark I am going to see like something on the scale like a a little bit of a loss and so that's kind of one of the reasons why I like having my refeeds in the morning and as soon as I finish my fasting journey I'm actually going to move my refeeds to the evening because that's actually when I would prefer to have them so um that's one of the reasons why I do that but anyways I 
just wow. These Rolling 72s, if I had known how amazing they were, I would have been doing them a long time ago. And um, I would have been doing them and eating like all my favorite junk food and things like that. And probably still would have had great success. So um, I definitely wish I had been doing them earlier, but you know, now is better than never. And tomorrow, when you see me, I am going to be in the 170s. I will be leaving the 180s for good, um, like tonight or tomorrow morning. And I cannot wait to get to the 170s because let me tell you, at 170, there are pictures of me with my little nephew, um, my first nephew, holding him. And I can't even tell I have a weight problem at 170. So I just... I am so close to getting there and these rolling 72s have just been an absolute dream come true for me and I'm so thankful for them. So anyways, I will see you tomorrow in the 170s. Have an amazing Monday. Take care. Bye.